Hi everyone, welcome back again to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Amy. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribe to my channel and also hit the notification bell so you're notified to my new upload video. And give me a big thumbs up and comment below section if you have any suggestions. In today's video guys, I'm gonna see what fits can this mini rectangular flap bag from Chanel so I still have the plastic guys because I want to protect the hardware of this uh, bag and I'm really happy that I got this finally it's really beautiful bag and it's cute I'm really decided also to get this rectangular instead of a uh, mini square uh, to be honest with you I was going to get the mini square because the, the strap length and also guys I'm gonna show you also how I shorten my strap of this bag let's see what it fits I have a few items in here guys so I always put everything in back and remove everything I also put this uh, tissue paper from them it has a Chanel everywhere by the way when I do this unboxing I have, uh, I forgot to mention that this one is made in France. Yeah, I don't know if you can see, guys. It says, in it? it's hard, guys. It's made in France. I'm really happy that it says made in France. And then, yep, I'm lucky that it's made in France. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to do a close-up of this bag so let's see what can fit. Let's see how many items can fit in this bag. But before I put anything else, like I mentioned that how I shorten my strap. So guys, I figure out, I'm looking like a, what's the name of this? Like a guard tear kind of material to tie this to. But I found this one on my Zara tag. I just cut this one, guys. It's a black. What I did just pull enough enough uh, length of your strap and then I will do is just do this all together so that one is enough for me and you can adjust it's long by the way because this one you can move so I just do this one together and then and tie the knot guy yeah. so do it twice so it at least it's hold more there it, it's actually it's already tied and I close this see the bag it's actually short now the strap it's it's on my uh, waist so I like the length like that and if you want to more longer what you do is just is just this just keep pushing down guys or adjust this thing until this one is get longer or you can undo again and put another longer and tie on this side to get more longer strap so that's how I shorten my my uh, my uh, chain of this bag that what it looks like I don't know if you guys like that but I don't mind that so that's how it look like when it's in a uh, if you tie the knot like that so I'm really glad that I found a way and I really love the gold hardware of this I don't know if it's a shiny gold or just rose gold so what we can fit in this small bag I have my I have don't have much care this is all the items that normally I carry for <laughs> hold on guys I drop <laughs> I drop my so this is my uh, first Chanel card holder that purchase let's put it that way and remember that uh, Hermes book and I always carry this now guys I write it things in there so I put this one flat like that 
and my key holder, sanitizer, and let's see my coin purse. See if this one will fit. Actually, fit much in there. And my Tom Ford lipstick. This is that. It's like a coral lipstick, guys. I really love this one in the daytime, especially with this one. See, it has space. There you go. Actually, it's not. It's not. It still have a little bit of space. Let's see this iPhone 4. It doesn't fit, guys. And it brings so much stuff. So, of course, I always carry my compact powder. That's pretty much in there that normally I carry. Let's see if I can close. There you go, guys. It's perfectly closed. It doesn't like bulky at all. Fits fine. Let's see, find the other way. If in case if I bring my phone, I will definitely uh, leave this one. I will put the phone in here. I have an iPhone 4 7, but I film it. But then also, guys, you can. This part it has a zipper compartment, so you can put up also in there. And it's another compartment, you can put up another one like a note. Let's see what else I can. Let me remove the coin first since I have the. Let's put. Let's see if the sunglasses would fit in here. I don't think I'm able to put the. The case. So let's fix this up. Put this in the back. So I just adjust guys so at least it will fit. So the sun glass is in there already. I always let me leave this out. So there you go. By the way, I don't like the way it wrinkle up in the back like this in here. It worries me, but anyway. Let's close that. It actually also fit my uh, sunglasses in there, Ray-Ban. I can use different kind of a uh, card holder. I don't have to use this Chanel one. But normally I always carry this one, phone. You see that way normally is. Because I have a uh, pocket. Is I can fit also that one in here. It fits a lot, guys. I need this since this all the time now and I have another lipstick in here it's from Chanel this is the full size let's see if it's fit so it's fit fine I can also put my other book in here and let's see actually I'm really surprised that everything I need it will fit in this bag I'm so happy that I get the rectangular one instead of um, the square one so I also I can put the notes in here like a, a receipt or something so there you go guys I I mentioned that I will leave this plastic in here uh, if I can find the what I call that one like a protector for this hardware it's a beautiful guys it's really nice and and I'm glad that it's shortened enough for my so look at that guy it looks just right here because I'm already shortened up let me see what it looks like so I mentioned it looks like that I don't know if I leave the mark around here but I will try to use this one as like that anyway because it's long and perfect guys I really love this one there you go guys that's it for my uh, what fits of this uh, Chanel mini rectangular flap bag and also how I shorten this chain again
thank you so much for watching guys until my next video bye